zoax.net. Lesson 0 Installation In this video, we will show you how to install what you need to write Java programs. To get started, open a browser. Then type this URL into the address bar, or go to our lesson page and left-click the link there. That will take you to the Java Downloads page. Left-click the NetBeans download icon shown here to go to the NetBeans download page. The appearance may change slightly as revisions change, so be sure to get the latest revision. Now that you are on the NetBeans download page, left-click the radio button to accept the license agreement and you should see this change. Below the license agreement, choose the appropriate download link for your computer and left-click it to start the download. Since I am on a Windows machine, I am choosing x86. There were some issues that I had with the x64 download, so you may want to try x86 even if you are on a 64-bit machine. Depending on your browser, you may see a message like this one, which asks whether you want to run or save the file. For simplicity, click Run. The download is large, so it will take a while to complete. When the download is done, you may get a warning message or two saying that the publisher is unverified. Left-click Run to continue the installation. Next, you should see this dialog and the progress bar as the installer starts up. When that is done, you will see the installation wizard shown here. Left-click Next. This brings up the license agreement for JUnit. To accept the terms, left-click this radio button, then left-click Next to go on. After that comes the JDK installation directory selection. I would recommend using the default directory and simply left-clicking Next. That will take you to the NetBeans installation directory selection. Again, accept the defaults and simply left-click Next. Finally, finish the installation wizard by left-clicking Install. This starts the installation, which will take a few minutes. When it is done, left-click the Finish button to complete the installation. Now the installation is finished. To open the IDE for programming, left-click the Start menu, and then left-click NetBeans inside the Start menu. That will start the NetBeans IDE, and you should eventually see a window like this one. You are now ready to code.